Right, so here's a really cool one for you uh, Play Family folks out there. This is the Fisher Price Play Family Camper. If you're ready to head out on vacation uh, with your Play Family, this is the one for you. About seven inches tall, how about, about a little over a foot wide, as you can see right here. And it's got all the three parts. It is really a cool piece. It's a harder one to find in the... Uh, the uh, Play Family catalog, so let's jump right into it. We're always happy when we get something like this into the gallery, into the studio. I'm gonna show you these isometric views right here so you can really just soak it in. All this late 70s, early 80s goodness. A little wear on the sticker right here. These ones, see, it's starting to peel. But uh, these colors are still vibrant. These are a little bit more faded. And we'll show you the back view with those doors that still uh, work. We'll show you that they work in a moment. I just want you to be able to see them uh, really full on and get some photos for the catalog. So you can see that they do still open. And inside you can see the, uh, the tiled floor, which is fun. I imagine these were a little bit more vibrant in the day. They've probably been sitting sun side up. So they are a little bit more orangish pink. Look at that. Check out that boat right there. We'll, we'll put it up this way so you can see it in the catalog. Does it not want to work? No, we might do a zoom over at the end. Ah, it doesn't want to work. <laughs> All right. So you can see in there uh, the crab, the fishing gear, etc. A little bit of wear right here. I'm feeling some dust but otherwise pretty nice. Designed to fit up to five of your little persons. You can see the bottom of it as well. Is that gonna stay for us? Nope. And it can be drug along on a string right here. So you can actually plop it into the water and see it go, which is kind of nice for some play value. The camper itself comes undone. We'll move this guy out of the way just so we can really focus on this. Becomes a little house play set. You got the bunks right up there. I don't know if they fit the bunk beds. It's kind of moot right now because these don't have them. We do have them available in another lot as part of a different set. But we'll show these from every angle so you can really get a, a feel for what's going on. We'll show you the top down view so you can really see that as well. And you can see all that detail. See little carrots in the cooking section there, in the little uh, stove area. So somebody took a lot of time. They realized that if you just spend an extra few minutes designing the stickers, uh, it doesn't cost anything extra, and you have tons of playware that the kids are really going to enjoy for a long time. All right, so we've got that. And then finally, we'll show you the car. You can hear, you can hear that. That is great. We'll show you the bottom. A little bit of a... I love that. That means it was thrown into a play box that had some crayons and some markers and stuff. It's got that. If you want to remove that, that's really easily done with some uh, Goo Gone. But I love that. I love that that that, uh, that provenance provided there. Love these big tires. I don't know if this will float. I'd really love to be able to check that out. We'll show you the front of it. You can see it seats up to three. And you got the back, which can conceivably put tons more. I'll show you all these isometric views, just so you can see it from every possible angle. And of course, you can head on over to thebigtoyauction.com and see the photos. Ah, we didn't show you this view. So you get to see that as well. And you can see all those photos in the catalog. While you're there, you can leave your pre-bids on this and any of the other items we've got coming at you. This week and every week, we've got a ton of stuff, no matter which way you choose to do it. We look forward to seeing you at that auction.